It's one of the biggest and most controversial construction sites in the nation. Of course, we're talking about the Second Avenue subway project. And I'm hoping at the Chamber of Commerce you can talk about who this is really for, who this information center will be benefiting. Is it people living here, tourists, or what type of information will they receive? Well, it's a little bit of everybody. It's mm -hmm. people living there. It's uh, school children who will come in. We actually have a wonderful art exhibit being uh, hung there now. Oh, wow. We're going to have business meetings there for all the small business owners. We're going to have a series of networking events. And bringing business back to Second Avenue, right? Correct, yes. We're really trying to bring more customers not only to the restaurants, but also to the retailers as they walk around before and after dinner and just bring more visibility because we have great stores and great restaurants and we're really trying to get people focused on that. Hi, my name is Marcus Samuelson and I'm so privileged to be here. Uh, today, I am the lucky winner of Restaurateur of the Year. I think it's absolutely fantastic that Manhattan Chambers of Commerce has this way of bringing people together, business, but more than anything, people. People are passionate about New York. I was incredibly honored last year to be um, honored by the Manhattan Chamber of Commerce for the work we do at Union Square Hospitality Group in New York City. I'm really excited to be here at the Chamber of Commerce. It's a well-populated, exciting event. Um, my company is Rent the Runway. We rent dresses to women for 15% of the retail price. So it's enabling many women to access luxury fashion. Hi, I'm Neil Blumenthal from Warby Parker. And we're just deeply honored to be here today to get honored in, in this amazing group of uh, sort of business leaders. So, so here's what I think about Lean In. Despite the fact that the words say, you know, you don't have to be a certain way and behave a certain way and act a certain way, I actually think between the lines all the way through, there is a suggestion of a, of a way to be and a kind of behavior. There's an aggressiveness to it that I think, but I, I actually, my own view is it's all about authenticity. 